Welcome to Zoological World today we will discuss about beetle. According to biologists, there are at least 400,000 species or types of beetle, all belonging to the Coleoptera order, the Endoterragoda suborder, and a great variety of lower classifications. These insects make up one quarter of all animal life forms, and most insects. They are found all over the world save in the oceans, Antarctica and the Arctic even though there are species built to withstand intense cold and others are at least semi-aquatic. Some are terrible pests, and some are beneficial. Though many are black or brown, others sport beautiful colors and patterns, with metallic or iridescent carapaces. They range from the smallest, Cytocella musawasensis to the largest, the Hercules beetle, which can grow to over 7 inches long. Incredible beetle facts. There are about 300 types of beetles that are eaten by humans, usually in the larval stage. These insects evolved around 270 million years ago. Though bug is the generic name for all kinds of insects, beetles and bugs are different. Beetles have hard forewings, or elytra, and their mouthparts are made for chewing. The exception to this are the blister beetles, which also have sucking tubes. The mouthparts of bugs are made for sucking and piercing. The larva of beetles can be told by other insect larvae because their heads are hard and often black. They have chewing mouthparts and spiracles, or tiny holes that allow them to breathe along their sides. Some are called grubs. Grubs eat organic material and the root of grasses and plants. How to identify beetles The adults always have wings, and their front wings are hard and are not used for flying. Instead, they are used to cover the hind wings, which are used for flying. When they close, they form a straight line down the back. The forewings extend all the way to the back of the abdomen. If they don't extend to the back of the abdomen, the insect is considered a true bug. Where to find beetles These insects can be found just about anywhere. Even a cursory glance at a tree or a shrub or plant will disclose some kind of beetle, which may be actively eating the plant or simply resting on it. They are found under rocks, under old bark, in rotting logs, and in dung heaps. They are found in and around food, on clothing, rugs, carpets, and upholstery. If a porch light is turned on, they will come flying to it. Aquatic beetles are mostly found in freshwater, though some of them do live in the shallow waters near the shore. The adults often carry an air bubble or have a modification to their exoskeleton to allow them to breathe underwater. What do beetles eat? The materials these insects eat nearly defy listing. Some only eat plant materials, others are scavengers, some are omnivores. Some restrict themselves to only one type of plant, while others are hunters that prey on other insects, spiders, snails, and earthworms. Others eat dung and carrion, while others eat beetles that eat dung and carrion. Many beetles rely on the presence of fungi in their gut to help them digest their food. How to get rid of beetles There are many ways of getting rid of beetle pests. They can simply be plucked from host plants and squashed or dropped into soapy water. They can be dusted with insecticidal powder, even though this will cause some collateral damage to insects such as butterflies and ladybugs. Their grubs can be exposed to nematodes or parasitic wasps. Sometimes controlling beetles is drastic. Lumber may need to be quarantined and treated with insecticide if it's feared it is harboring pests. Sometimes forests full of trees need to be cut down and burnt to stop an invasion of a wood-boring beetle. 